I think it's real important for us to realize that something may have happened to us that we had no control over maybe when we were a child. Um, we, we were victimized. But as an adult, we have a choice. We can take control of our lives. We can take responsibility for our lives. And we can change our lives. Um, you know, Henry Ford said... Um, um, if you think you can do so- a thing or if you think you can't do it, then you're right. <laughs> okay, so, so what is in our mind truly does impact what we do. And 90% on average, the statistics, people who have researched this, say that 90% of our thoughts are negative. Wow. That's an incredible, um, mind-blowing statistic, and I'm going to repeat it. Ninety percent of our thoughts are negative. How, how is that possible? It, it's we are. It's there are tapes that play in the back of our head that we're not even aware of, hmm. and until we become conscious of them, they're going to continue to take us down a negative path hmm. and limit us. And, and that's the worst thing, is limiting us from becoming who we're really meant to be and who we can be that's beyond anything that we ever could have imagined. Yeah. I mean, if you had told me I'd be sitting here doing this show today, I would have told you you're crazy. <laughs> I was looking for a show to be on. <laughs> <laughs> And suddenly, here I am hosting a show. And so as we begin to say yes to our life and opportunities that arise and say, yes, I can do that, as Henry Ford said, and said, no, I can't do that. I have no training. No one told me that I'm capable of doing that. But to know within ourselves, yes, that that is my path and yes i can do that and not only that i want to do that this is something i've really been seeking um whether i knew it or not and suddenly there it is and it resonates and it's yes this is the time to do it um now i could have allowed myself to be flooded with worry mm. and and what they say is that we spend 1 to 8 hours a day worrying now if you do the math and you get 8 hours of sleep a night and you're one of the people who worries 8 hours a day that means 16 hours half of your day half of your day you're worrying oh my god And that's a lot of us are doing that. That's on the extreme end. Some of us only worry an hour a day. (laughs) But think about what you could be doing in that hour if you weren't worrying. And then some people say, well, it's the worry that prevents the bad things from happening. No, because in fact, only 8% of what we worry about actually happens. Mm. And if we stopped Worrying, we are not preventing those things from happening. My guess is, is that if we gave up worrying altogether, that eight percent wouldn't even happen. Right. It might come down to one or two percent because and- we're drawing in those negative experiences as we think negative thoughts, which is what worrying is.